Welcome to West Island, population 120 people. It has the Cocos Keeling Islands only airport and most government services and communications are here, plus some tourism accommodation. On West Island, you can hire a scooter to zip around on. Doesn't take that long though to get from one end of the CBD to the other. See, told you it wasn't far. It's here we meet Tony. He's a local turning sea salt and coconut chips into a thriving export business. These products are on their way to the Bunbury Farmers Market. So last year we released a range of coconut chips. We realised that salt is heavy to get it off the island into the mainland, so we produced a range of lightweight health food snacks. Tony has the only farm on the island. He also runs the cafes in town. June to October on the island is peak time for kite surfers. Wind surfers, kite surfers, it's one of the best places in the world to come and experience. We've also got a couple of really good surf breaks that roll and perform all year. We've been invited to the end of year party. Each year, government workers come and go, which brings new opportunities and new friends. They're very, very welcoming and um, you feel like you're part of the community almost as soon as you get here. Once you've arrived, it doesn't take long for the aquatic beauty and relaxed lifestyle to win your heart. For us to go for a kite or a surf or a fish or a dive, uh, it's an after work activity. And there's always a little sadness when friends leave. Definitely miss everybody here and I'm not sure that, um, yeah, I'm not sure what you follow Cocos up with really. But this get together and bonfire really encapsulates the heart of the community here. On a warm, balmy island night, what could be better?